The first swath of moisture now pushing up into portions of Canada, but we have another round down to our south. Now you can see the severe part has really blanketed a good portion of Ohio, and we kind of steer clear of all that lightning, but it's on the back edge of this system, what you see towards Peoria and northern Indiana, that will eventually make its way to southeastern Michigan. So a few spotty scattered showers can't be ruled out heading into the middle part of the afternoon. Start off the morning in the Tri-City area with rain. That has since fizzled out, so we're dry for now, but it is a soggy start and sticky out out there with the humidity around the lunch hour or when those showers kind of redevelop and you'll be in and out of them throughout the early part of the afternoon. 72 for the afternoon high, so we're 10 degrees below average, but it doesn't really feel cool when you factor in the humidity because it will have that sticky feel. Clouds and radar forecast for today overcast skies throughout the morning and then you see how we have a couple of those little spotty showers noon till about two or three. By five, though, we start to peel back that cloud cover and we should have a pretty dry night ahead. A few more clouds will mix in heading into your Tuesday, though. Now new data indicating that we could get a splash of rain by about six o'clock down to our south. I'm not putting all my eggs in this basket because this is really the first data run that we're seeing of bringing in some of that moisture for late Tuesday. But nonetheless, I want to be transparent with you and make sure that you are prepared in case we do get a passing shower. Otherwise, tonight we'll say mostly cloudy 60 winds start to pick up out of the north 10 to 20 miles per hour and tomorrow partly sunny, less humid, breezy, that slight chance of an afternoon shower, but those winds could gust around 25 miles per hour. Winds will pick up those we had in the afternoon today coming out of the northwest, gusting maybe around 15 miles per hour, but they definitely pick up going into your Tuesday. That's going to help push out that humidity. So you see uh, less mugginess for your Tuesday, even Wednesday, but it's then Thursday that we start to see that green building back in. That would indicate some moisture that could come in the form of some rain showers come Thursday. So your future forecast, coolest days today, but we will be warming back up into the 80s throughout the rest of the work week. Wednesday, really the pick day, mid 80s with sunshine. So there's your pool day for you. And then as of right now, looking at the upcoming weekend, mix of sun and clouds and seasonal highs in the low 80s.